Thanks to Boomerang Alliance supporters like you, there's been a big push for the truth about the damaging effects plastic litter is having on our oceans. And we're having some great success with implementing solutions, real solutions. Like Green Senator Peter Wish Wilson launching a Senate inquiry to address this massive issue. I can't think of a bigger global pollution issue than plastics in our ocean. The ocean is turning into a plastic soup. One of the worst contributors to plastic litter and marine debris comes from the beverage sector. After years of campaigning, New South Wales has just committed to implementing a container deposit system. And we're very pleased that the Senate committee has also recommended that all states have these systems in place by 2020. It's great that we're finally addressing container litter. Now we can step up our efforts and address all marine litter, including plastics directly released into the environment through personal hygiene products, like facial cleansers, exfoliants and detergent, or indirectly through litter breaking down more slowly, like plastic bags and bottles. The environmental and health effects of plastics in our oceans are devastating. Researchers predict that 99% of the world's seabird species will suffer from plastic ingestion by the year 2050. And the World Economic Forum recently predicted that there will soon be more plastic in the ocean than fish. This has huge implications, not just for the ocean, but for our health too. The Senate report talks about a looming health crisis from the contamination of seafood, which of course goes up to the food chain where us humans eat the seafood. This is a very serious issue. Much of the marine litter in Australia's oceans actually comes from Australian consumers and manufacturers. But what's the solution? At the Boomerang Alliance, we're committed to cutting 70% of plastic pollution entering the ocean by 2020. The good news is we can enforce existing laws around the dumping of plastics like nurdles, which are very small pellets of plastic used in manufacturing. Also, other states can now follow New South Wales' lead by implementing cash for containers. And finally, we just need to ban those unnecessary plastic products like single-use bags. And now the Senate committee agrees with us and has finally put on the table recommendations that you, I and the Boomerang Alliance have been campaigning and advocating for. So what can we do to turn words into action? The Boomerang Alliance is the peak campaign body on waste and recycling. We're an action group. The Alliance has been instrumental in giving us information. There's, their research base has been terrific. The Boomerang Alliance has given us opportunities to channel community action towards something very powerful like policy change. Now, more than ever, it's important to keep the pressure on and build an unstoppable momentum to help clean up Australia's plastic pollution for good. Be part of the solution. Join us. To find out more about the Boomerang Alliance, our campaigns and how you can help, go to our website.